on this computer. And then, I don't know, it should do it like when they come in. Let me do, let me do it again. All right, well, we are recording. I'm gonna make sure everybody's muted. Mute all, current and new participants, yes. Okay, everybody should be muted. Is that better? Yeah? Okay, good. All right, guys. Well, welcome. We're at the, this is so exciting to be able to share this with you guys that this is our Veerling Executive Director Team National Conference um, Team Time. And so I am so excited again. I hope you guys, um, if anybody was able to be on the Home Office Direct Team Time earlier that you heard me talk a little bit about our journey um, and uh, just, uh, it's just extremely exciting to be here um, and to be here with you guys, that you guys are making this up. Um, so I'm really um, super excited about it. So welcome all of you. Um, tonight, this is a really fun time that we get to have every year at conference. It's all about celebrating your achievements from this past year. And some of you just started recently. Some of you have been around for a while. We're gonna really celebrate all of it. And you're gonna see where, um, where everybody sort of stacks up. And then we're also gonna have some fun too. And because we're virtual and because I don't, you know, it's hard to send bags, I have prizes, lots of prizes. So um, we are going to be giving, I'm gonna be giving out lots of prizes tonight. So we're gonna have fun. So, and here we're gonna do um, Shannon, Director Shannon Heath is gonna help me. Are you ready, Shannon? Do we have everybody in the wheel of winners? Uh, no, cause you keep changing the screen and I lose people. Oh, okay. So <laughs> you wanna keep? Give me, give me like Roseanne's five. trying to get in. But she can't. Okay, I'll, I'll help Roseanne too. Okay, so we'll wait. We'll come back to that because we're going to just do some winners just because you're here. We're just going to do some winners. So let's do this. I'm here. Do what? I'm here. Who's here? Now. Oh, Rose. Okay, mute yourself, Rose. Everybody's muted. All right, Rose is here. Make sure you get her on the wheel of winners. Okay, so let's go on. Let's go on and do our next thing. While Shannon's doing that, we'll come back. Um, to do some more of this too. Um, we are gonna go on again and we're gonna do a little practice round with this cahoots, okay? Some of you again are going, yeah, like I'm a teacher, like I do these cahoot things all the time, like I totally know what I'm doing. I have no idea what I'm doing. So um, I thought it would be a good idea to do a practice round. Um, so you either again needed to download, download Kahoot onto your phone or your iPad, go to kahoot.it or something on another device. You're gonna watch the questions and answers here. I'm gonna share them on this big screen. Um, and then you're gonna answer them on your app, wherever you just downloaded it okay does everybody understand that so we're gonna do a little practice okay I just made a dumb practice one so let me stop um, let me do a new share and I will go into here and let's Anna we need a game pin for Kahoot yeah I'm gonna give that to you just hold your put your pants on for a minute I'm gonna give it to you one sec one sec I'm gonna give it to you Oh wait, this is not rigged. Okay, let me go to play. Okay, I'm gonna host it, right? Okay, and we're gonna do classic and it's gonna give you a pin here in a minute. All right, so start. Okay, so there's your pin. Do you guys see the pin? So everybody put the pin in because then you'll be, you'll be into the game, okay? Let me see some thumbs up. Everybody got the pin in? Everybody good with the pin? Yes? No, not yet, Erica? Thumbs up when you got the pin. Dixie, I don't see a thumbs up. Heather, are you good? Okay, Dixie's getting it. I know this music is not as good as the DJ, but we'll just deal with it. Oh good, I see. Oh, see, now I can see what's happening. I see all the people that are in. Oh, look at you guys. All right. Okay, are we good to start? People are coming in, okay. So again, you're gonna wanna watch up here for the question, and then you're gonna put the answer into your thing. It's gonna give you, I think that gives you like 
15 to 20 seconds. So it is timed. So, you know, don't be farting around. Like you need to focus, Joanne, okay? Yeah. <laughs> okay, ready? Here we go. So this is a practice one, okay? Practice. Here we go. So here's the first question. What year is it? That's the question. There's your four answers to choose from. Ten seconds left. I don't think the net, okay, so we did. Okay, good. So, okay, so somebody got it wrong, but that we're just gonna say this is practice, so it doesn't matter. So that I don't know who that person is, but we're just gonna deal. Okay. So here we go. So everybody got some points, and you get points by how fast you answer to. So let's go to the next question. True or false? True or false? Today is July 9th. See, and it's all the way up at the top again. If you didn't see it, it's at the top, the question again. So you can choose true or false. Oh, uh, everybody must have answered because it just stopped it then. Okay. Some people don't know what the date is. That is all right. Okay, next, see, it's like Michelle Chick is in, she knows the codes. All right, next question. Last question on a practice. Our team time started at, look at you guys go. Somebody, I don't know what time they think we're starting. So, okay, so there, okay, everybody good? So now we can see who won. Oh, Katrina got third. Amy Dolan got second. Number one, Michelle Chick won the practice run. All right. All right, so let me do, everybody good. Wait a minute, let me shut this off. So this is gonna be fun. Wait, listen, when we master this, we're gonna be doing this all the time now, just be ready. All right, so let's stop this share. Is anybody crying right now? I'm crying because they... I got fifth. Because <laughs> you got fifth? Lisa, are you okay? Lisa and I practiced this last night at 10.30 and I said, if Lisa can get it, anybody can get it. I can get it and I want you to know, I answered them all correct too. You did Tonight great job. you did, last night you did not. <laughs> <laughs> I was new. I know. I think you got them all wrong last night. Okay. So yay, Michelle. All right, Michelle, yeah. you're going to get a prize for winning the practice one just because I want you to. So I'm just going to put your name on here. Thank you. Okay. All right. Is everybody ready? And totally. um, Shannon, how are you right now? I, I think I have everybody. Okay. But Let's do um, this. Let's play. A, let's play one the game. Let's play one game. This is going to be a how well do you know your fellow consultants? This is going to be very fun. So we're going to play that. And then after that, we'll do some Wheel of Winners. Okay, Shan? Do we have to put the game pin in every time? Yes, because it'll be a new game. So, okay. yeah? so get ready. So I'm going to give you a new game pin here. Let me do this. Let me get into what I'm doing and then I'll. Uh, I act like I know what I'm doing, but you guys know by now, I'm not really sure about anything. That, okay, team time Kahoot. Okay. Um, play, post. I'm gonna do this before I show it to you so you don't know me, you don't see me going crazy around. Okay, so let me share it with you and I'm gonna give you, you're gonna see the pin, everybody's gonna get the pin in there. Okay, everybody see it? So go ahead and put your pin in. You don't see it? Does everybody see it? Yeah, I see some people putting, okay, good. I see, you must see it, because I see you guys doing it. You don't see this pin up here at the top? Oh, I saw a um, code word of big smoker. I know who that is. Big smoker. <laughs> That's our Don. I know it's our Don. All right. 
How many should we have? How many people? I see 35. That's about what, how many we had before. So everybody's good. Okay. Nobody's crying. Okay. Here we're going to go. We're getting ready to play. Get ready. All right. Get watch. ready. All right. Let's get ready to start. I feel like I got to move this thing at the thing. All right. Ready? What is the percentage of consultants who filled out the form who are within their first year of business? 25%, 33%, 45% or over 50%. Percentage of consultants who are within their first year of business. I don't know who's drawing on the page. <laughs> All right, 15 of you got it, that it is, it's 50%, over 50% of everybody that's here that filled that out, it's within your first year. So you're going to like get this little tease this month, this year, and then you're just going to want to come with us to Chicago next year. All right, ready? We're going to ready for the second one. Oh, look at Barbara Marston. Who is writing on the page? <laughs> Random writing. Sabrina, is that you writing on the page? <laughs> All right, next question. What is a state that is not represented in our organization? Texas, Oklahoma, Arizona, or Utah? Look at you guys. Some people know that. Da -da 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 -da. Let's see. And I think all the people in the ones that are on this call right now. Wow, look at it is Arizona is actually the answer. Oh, that was a good one to trick you guys on. Good. Let's see who got that one. Who's up, oh, Barbara? Got, oh, Allison is in the lead now. Ding, 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 ding. This is so fun. Oh, so these people must have gotten it right. So Allison got it right. Kathy, um, Krista got it right. All right, good. It means they moved up. It means, it means oh, it does? Moved, yeah. Okay, thank you, because I don't know. Okay, good. We're doing this all the time, guys. Like, we're gonna do like a weekly cahoots. I'm just gonna make stuff up. We're gonna do this, just because it's so fun. All right, next one, true or false? The Deep Cover Baker is one of the top favorite products of our organization, true or false? Remember, that was a question. What is your most favorite product? Was the Deep Covered Baker one of the top answers? Oh, we have over 40 people on here. You guys are good. Somebody knows the writing on here. Look at you guys going crazy. Actually, it was false. That was not one that you guys picked. So let's see who moved up. This is very exciting because it's going all, oh, Chef Terry is in. She <laughs> moved right up to the top. That's so exciting. Look at you guys. I love that it moves. All right, next one. The one product that most consultants on our organization don't have, but they wish they did, is the air fryer, the mix and chop, the pots and pans, or the salad chopper, aka the chicken chopper. This is a lot of pressure. I'm not sure I'm playing this in my classroom anymore, because now I feel like one of my students. Oh, I got oh, it right. you guys got it. Yay! It's the air fryer. It's probably because everybody's is on back order. That's what it is. Let's see who moved around. Oh, Michelle Chick. But look how close it is. And Lisa Curry are only 40 points away. Very exciting. Shelly's creeping up. All right. Ready for the next one? What percentage of consultants in our group are attending national conference for the first time? 95%, 68%, 44%, or 22%? Percentage of our group that are attending for the first time. Oh, you guys, you smarty McFarties. Good job. Where is it? Uh oh. Oh, Michelle Chick. Oh my God. I hope there's a no lead. Chicago. 
She's a she's a queen. Because again, if, the faster you answer, the more points you get. So get your finger, your trigger fingers ready. Erica, trigger finger ready. Good. All right. Next one. Which product was not guessed as a possible new fall product? Coffee maker, a mixer, a cherry pitter, or a crepe maker? Crepe oh, maker. The answers are, I hear you. Who is that? Sabrina? Me. Who is, I can't see who's talking. Not anymore. Oh. The cherry pitter was correct. Oh my gosh, I was actually going to put that because I was hoping they were going to bring that back again. That's so funny that you put that as one of these. Well, that's the one I picked because I would like them to do that. Let's see what happens. Michelle. All right, who's going to bump Michelle out? Next one, true or false? Overwhelmingly, the group chose everything as what you're most excited about for National Conference. True or false? Wow, you guys are quick. Look, I see you, Brenda McDonald. You had your trigger finger ready on that one, I know. All right, 37, you're right. Let's see, uh-oh, somebody bumped Michelle. Who is Aloe? It's me, I just fat fingered it and I hit the wrong vowel. Who's, who, Allie? Yes. <laughs> I got too excited and I hit the wrong vowel. <laughs> All right, good. All right, good, good, good. All right, let's go. Next. True or false? Most of us will be drinking water tonight. True or false? When you were asked about what you would drink, most of us will be drinking water tonight. True or false? Oh, yeah. Lisa got this one wrong, too. <laughs> we're not a bunch of winos like you would think that we are. The mo majority of people said they were having water tonight. I think we are a bunch of winos. We're just a bunch of liars. I mean, <laughs> Alicia popped right up. I actually think I thought I was going to drink something else, but I actually have my water because I got a headache. So it's been a long day. All right. Now we're on number nine of 12. Two top two types of food that you chose to go out to eat are French and Indian. Italian and Asian, Italian and American, or American and Mexican? Which one did you guys, what were the top two that you guys chose? And you were right. Well, some of most, we're about half and half on that lesson. So I did a good job tricking you. Let's see what happens here. Oh, Alicia. Alicia stayed up there. All right, you can still, there's still three more questions. You can, you guys can jump ahead. Majority, over 50% of our team work another full-time job, work another part-time job, or do Pampered Chef solely. Over 50%, majority of our team work full-time, work part-time, or do Pampered Chef solely. Yes, you guys got that, 29%. Oh, Alicia, look at Alicia. Who is drawing on the page? <laughs> Getting worse. I think it's Krista. All right. Which traditional occupation is not held by one of your teammates? A Mexican restaurant owner, a bus driver, a soldier or a bottler. One of these is not held. Which one is not held? Three of these your teammates are doing. Yeah, Mexican restaurant. I know, <laughs> I think that's the one you did too, Lisa, was the bottler. We do have a bottler. I don't remember who it is, but somebody is a bottler at a, at a distillery or a something. Oh, that's you, Rose. That's right. I should know that. So yeah, Rose, you're the one who stumped everybody. Oh, Alicia's still up there. Rose, you're close. 
All right, last question, 12 out of 12. When asked where your dream destination would be, the place that got the most votes, Hawaii, Rome, Australia, or Iceland? Oh, it was Rome, actually. Rome was the one. It was crazy. Like, there were some random, like, Italy things, but Rome was majority. That was one that more people than not had chose that. So let's see what that does. Here's our podium. Lisa C. got third place. Number two is Rose. Number one, Alicia. Alicia. See, you guys are pretty safe playing with me because I can't even cheat and win. <laughs> That's right. You played this one already last night. I missed three of them that I answered already. <laughs> I don't usually win these, so it's pretty. Ex I was expecting to lose them all the way. I'm like, what? <laughs> really? These are some of the fun games that we usually play when we're at conference together. I, we could get a, this is as creative as we can get when we're virtually. So I hope was that fun for you guys? Yes, no. I think so. We're gonna we're gonna do a little more cahooting later on in the um, evening too. So how about Shannon? Do we want to do some wheel of winners? We can do that. All right. So I Shannon has a wheel of winners. So she's got a wheel with everybody's name in it. And you have, to, Chuck, you have to Chuck Mitchell in the enable background. my sharing, darling. Yeah, let me get you, let me enable you sharing. Share screen. All right, you should be, hi, Krista. All right, you should be able to. Can you share now? Yep. All right, so she's going to share our wheel of winners. And let's pick a winner. Where's the wheel? There's no wheel. It's name picker ninja. Oh, okay. So just, so just watch. It does this. Okay. Do it. So it's a whoa, Haley! Yay. Haley! That's Haley Har one. Yay, Haley! Let me write it. You know what? Let's do another Go one. Haley. Go, Haley. <laughs> Yay, Haley. I, oh, do you want me to take right. my name out? Um, yeah, let's take her name out and we'll do another one. Okay. Let's do another one. Because this is fun. <gasps> Heather Gallant. Yay, Heather. Do, do, do. This is super fun. All right, let's just do another one. Ready? Are you ready, Jen Fournier? I see your face. Barbara Marston's ready. Don, you ready? Yep, I'm oh, ready. Alicia won again! Woo! That just from the Wheel of Winners. All right. Good, good, good. All right, Shannon, we'll come back to this and do some more. Um, okay. Yeah. But that's good. Yay! All right. Some winners. I got a lot more. I still have a whole lot more. Even though Michelle even won the, the practice one, they still have more. So we're going to keep playing. Okay, so here's what we're going to do now. We're going to start one of the um, really fun things about um, National Conference and when we do this team time is that we're able to um, really do some um, recognition. And I think that's always really important for us to do. I'm trying to see if I can get this. What? Can you guys see me trying to struggle with this? How can we get it to be up on this? Oh, there we go. Um, to um, get do some recognition here. So the first recognition that we're going to do, and the recognition that I do um, and that we do is actually it's the same. So that you know, it's the same time period as excellence. So it started on um, it started on June first of 2019 and went till May 31st of 2020. So somebody might go, oh, well, I totally should have been or got that or something last month. That's, it's just the, the um, it's just how it goes is that it ends. I'm just gonna mute everybody too because I know sometimes people jump in and they're not um, muted. So um, 
So that's where it goes. So May, uh, June 1st from last year until May this year. So I wanna do recognition top 10 in sales um, for, the, um, for the year. So this is with number 10, at the number 10 is brand new director Jacqueline Truland with $20,338. Yay, Jacqueline! Number nine with twenty four thousand eight hundred and seventy eight director Becky Jenkins. Yay, Becky! Everybody do the clapping. Yay, Becky! Number eight consultant Allison Goodwin with thirty thousand nine hundred and forty four dollars. Yay, Allison! Number seven team leader Jessica Gilbert. $32,572. Remember, this is in the whole organization, in the entire organization, including directors. That's where you guys are with this. Number six, with 33,107, is director Tori Snowdeal. Number five, with director Martian Crane with $39,082. Yay, Martian! Number four, director Lisa Corey with 44,000, 11, one of 10, one of 10. Number three, advanced director Katrina Purington with $47,952. Now we're getting into the top two. Number two, director Heidi Coffin with $52,018. Yay, Heidi! Number one, 84,953 is director Jennifer Howe. Yay, in the whole organization. Way to go. That is awesome. Great job, guys. That's really exciting. Um, now we're going to go into the recognition, the top 10 of the, um, in our organization for recruiting. And these numbers are always really fun too. I'll just let you know if there's any ties in numbers, they, the number that they got within the top 10 is based on their sales. So if, if, if the several people got the same number, the, whoever had the higher sales was higher up in the list, okay? So number 10, with two is brand new director, Katie Isaac. Yay, Katie! <laughs> Number nine with two, director Shannon Heath, our Wheel of Winners girl. Yay, Shannon! Number eight, director Becky Jenkins with three new consultants. <laughs> Number seven, team leader Jessica Gilbert with three new consultants. Yay, Jess! Number six, Director Martian Crane with three new consultants. Number five, Director Heidi Coffin with four new consultants. We're in the top five now. Number four, Director Lisa Curry, not Lisa Coffin, with five, two, sorry Lisa, that's Lisa Curry. The one that can't even cheat even though she did the game last night, she still couldn't win today, so. All right, number three, advanced director Katrina Purington with seven new consultants. Number two, director Jennifer Howe with seven new consultants. Wait till you get this one. Number one, with 11 new consultants. Director Tori Snowdeal. Yay, Tori! <laughs> It's just so fun. So great job, guys. Again, we everybody here knows because we keep talking about it. We have had explosive growth over the last um, few months and actually the last six months. So um, just so excited. I just love having um, so many new consultants join our team and just making us bigger and better and stronger. Um, so that's super exciting. All right, let's do this. Um, let's do some more Wheel of Winners. Shannon, do you want to jump on and do the uh, another few with the Wheel of Winners? Are you ready? Shannon Heath? And if you're Colleen? Right. Hold on, it's saying I can't. Got no. it. What are you doing, Shannon? Oh, here we go. All right, let's do some more Wheel of Winners.
Cheryl. Doot, doot, Cheryl. But there was no last name, so. Um, I think we only have one Cheryl. Cheryl, what's your last name? I think I know it. You could type it in the chat, Cheryl. I'll find it. I'll find out who, who it is. I know all things. All right, next thing. Let's see who else. Let's do another one. <gasps> Jennifer Fournier. She had her game face on. Yay, Jen. All right, let's do one more, Shein. This is so fun. <gasps> Rose Bolton, our butler. Yay, Rose. <laughs> All right, let's just do one more, just because this is fun. <laughs> I just love it. It's like playing the lottery. Sabrina, Gina! Sabrina! All right, good. Let's take, we'll do that for now. We'll do that for now, and then we're going to go into. Um, one of the other things that we do at conferences, again, and you guys have sort of seen this, that we have special recognition that happens at conference. So we did, we did our top from our organization, but then we also had some special recognition um, that I want to show you guys, um, just that you will see throughout the next couple days, and it's all from right here in our organization. So you guys will be up um, and ready for that. So. Yeah, uh, 25. Are you ready? Yeah, totally. We're so excited to give them ice cream. Let me go ride them up. Oh, ice, cream. ice cream. Ice cream truck is here. Who's, where's the ice cream truck? I hear ice cream truck. Who was that? I want some too. I don't know. I want some ice cream truck. Okay. So special, first thing we did excellence. And I know we talk about this a little bit, that excellence is, um, that again, there's four different categories you can get excellence in. One of them is sales, and that's if you sell $55,000 within the year. Um, recruiting is the other one, and that's 15 qualified recruits. Um, the other one is developing leaders, and so there's sort of a point six system on whether you have team leaders or directors, and the other one is an overall organization um, one. So we have somebody on our team that did earn excellence, and she earned excellence in personal sales, and that would be Director Jennifer Howe. Yay, Jen! Jen won for, um, she's going to be um, doing, she got one of those Tiffany bracelets, um, which was really cute to get those. And um, the other one of the big rewards we get with excellence as well is that we get a deposit of Pampered Chef dollars into our um, Pampered Chef account, like 500. So that's always a big um, benefit to that as well. So congratulations, Jennifer, again, when you get excellence, that really puts you up into that top 1% of the entire company. Um, so Jen had, um, was able to do that. So great job, Jennifer. The other thing is that there's something that they call career club and there's certain levels when it comes to sales and recruiting that you can hit and that they, um, that they um, uh, recognize and it is um, the career club. So there's just different levels that they have and it's a career cumulative. Um, so this is those levels. So for example, was it last year? uh or the year before terry would know this that we terry and i both hit the one million dollar mark so in our career we hit one million dollars that's a big deal um, it was a year before anna two years ago okay good it was my first conference and i took a picture of your name on the wall at home office i know you're so cute i don't even think i knew my name was there but good all right so yeah so that's a big deal here so that was so that happened that was um but again so it's your career throughout your career so here we do have several people that hit career club for sales this year for the fifty thousand level with michelle lamoro and katrina purington both hit that yay ladies Woo. anna your sound is all wonky mine is again yeah all right, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to go out and I'll be right back. That's what I have to do. I need a new computer. That's what Anna's going to do. Mm -hmm. 